Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And a uh, question that I've seen on the um, comments and that I regularly uh, see also, and even some were commenting on this, there is one flaw in Windows updates. And, of course, we look at the uh, bug fixes update today. Uh, the comment had to do with, well, I see the update that wants me to go to 22H2, but I don't see the bug fixing update appear. And um, it on Windows 11, it does pretty much the same thing. Um, it seems that when you go to Windows updates, if there is already something there that wants to be offered to you as an update, it kind of prevents some updates to actually appear to be installed. So there's kind of a blockage. It happened many times in the past. We saw feature updates popping up, and people then realized that the regular updates aren't popping up. They're not there, and they're not being offered. And it's mostly because that feature update is kind of taking all the place, and it's like, well, you got to do this. Once you do this, we'll give you the availability, the possibility to go with the Windows updates after that. And that is kind of a flaw in Windows Update. Um, the cumulative updates are great, and they are a, a much better way to update the system. But that flaw that happens when you're in that situation it kind of you know tells us that maybe there should be some fix for Windows Update. There should be an option that says, well, click here so I don't get this, and then you know make me make me make appear the the ones that I want. Uh, it's very weird, and uh, it's I guess by design and the way that the Windows updates are done, and this happens both in Windows 10 and Windows 11. Uh, even though Windows 11, they tweaked the Windows Update system to make it uh, more efficient and better, it still has that flaw that a proposed update can prevent you from seeing another update that is available and that should be installed. It's a weird system. Um, I think there's maybe a fix that could be in there that could be interesting to uh, to to fix that as a kind of a problem because, you know, it's, yeah, you could say, well, you know, just install 22H2. Yeah, but in the case where someone might not want to do it now and they want to wait, um, it shouldn't block other updates from being available. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.